Just finishing up my first Training Peaks workout that I imported to Zwift. Gonna finish up this ride and then I'll show you how to do it in just one second. So lucky for us in 2018, Zwift and Training Peaks make this really simple. It takes a little bit of knowledge of how to use Finder and Mac, but that's about it. So I'm gonna jump right into Training Peaks. As long as you have a workout, whether it's from your coach or from a training plan, Training Peaks will generate a uh, workout file that's compatible with Zwift. So first we're gonna go right here, open up the workout, click on export workout file. You'll see this ZWO file best for Zwift. Click that, you're gonna download it. I'll save it to my desktop to make things simpler. The next thing you wanna do is make sure that Zwift is closed. Then we need to find the workouts folder for Zwift. Generally, the Zwift folder just lives in your documents. To find it quickly, just open up Spotlight, search for Zwift, and right here, Zwift Documents, that's the folder we want. Open that up, you'll see I have a few workouts here. If you don't have this workouts folder, just go ahead and create it, but it should be there. Then all you have to do is just go to the file that you just downloaded on your desktop, drag it into workouts. Now when you launch Zwift, go to the training section, go to custom workouts, and you should see your workout right there. So hopefully that was a helpful tip. I'll put a link to the official documentation down below. Please like this video, subscribe to this channel for any future tutorials, um, special edition daily vlogs, and follow me on Instagram to see how this working dad triathlete mid-pack age grouper trains and balances life. Thanks, I'll see you next time.